One of Zana, my favourite activities in the summer is to have a barbecue. And today, we're having my favourite, sausages. But remember, a barbecue in the garden can also be full of potential danger. Don't stay out in the sun too long, or you could get burned. Not a worry for me, Chris. I never use anything less than Factor 30. All right, well, be careful when you're playing ball games, where you could hit someone on the head. Not if you only use it for air guitar. Well, in that case, we can get on and enjoy the barbecue. Zond, food's ready, sausages and piping hot beans. Ah! My leg! The piping hot beans have burnt my leg! Injury alert! What should you do if someone is badly burned? A. Never eat anything hot ever again. B. Cool the burn with cold running water for at least 10 minutes, then cover it with cling film and call 999. Or C. Shout out, if you can't stand the heat, stay out of the kitchen. Well, the correct answer is B. Cool the burn with cold running water for at least 10 minutes, then cover it with cling film and call 999. Let's see if this lot get it right. They've not had any advice, so they're winging it. Go. Nicholas and Rohanna are both pretending that they've been badly burned. Quick, everyone, they need your help. OK, let's go. They've used alcohol gel, which would be very painful if you had a burn. They're putting on a gauze bandage right onto the burn. Not a good idea on a severe burn. You have to take a picture. So they've thought of using the phone, but unfortunately they've used the phone to take a selfie. <laughs> Time to show you how it should be done. Ah! Ow! It hurts! I burn myself! Remember, we're showing you what to do in an emergency, but it's always best to get an adult. Don't worry, Zand, it's all going to be fine. We pour cold running water over it for 10 minutes using a hose like this. That is the most important thing you can do because it reduces the temperature and it reduces scarring. So we do need to get Zahn to hospital. And a good way of doing that is by calling 999. After 10 minutes of cold water, we then want to put cling film on and put it on the burn like that. So when you get a bad burn, you lose the top layer of skin. And that means you're at risk of infection. And so cling film acts like temporary skin. Well, thanks, Chris. My burn's feeling better already. Right, who's ready to have another go? Yes! So if you see someone who's badly burned, you must. Use cold running water to cool the burn for 10 minutes. Cover the burn in cling film or a clean plastic bag to reduce pain and keep it clean. Call 999 and continue to put cold water on top of the cling film until paramedics arrive. How's the legs, on? Oh, it's much better, thanks. Good, good. Uh, what are you doing with these sausages? Well, I've eaten mine. They were delicious, by the way. But I'm afraid yours got rather badly burnt, so I've poured cold water on them for 10 minutes and then I wrapped them in cling film. <sighs> Chris, someone's had an accident and it's an emergency. Well, we better head to the emergency department. Right. <laughs> Waiting in the emergency department with his dad is 10-year-old Haddy. That's a big bandage. What have you done, Haddy? I've cut my hand. Oh, no! Haddy was in the school hall, trying to get into his Jaguar costume. A Jaguar costume? Was Haddy a superhero changing into his cool costume to save the day? Is it a bird? Is it a plane? No! It's Jaguar Boy! No, Zahn, he was hanging out with his friends. Jake the Anteater and Jamie the Monkey. Wow! I didn't know animals could go to school. No, Zahn, they were dressed up as animals. They were all getting ready for the school play. Paddy was nearly ready when he slipped on his costume, knocked a table and sent a glass flying. While trying to steady himself, he put his hand right in the broken glass. Ouch! isn't any glass in my hand because I would need to get stitches. Well, we'd better find out quick then. It's over to Dr. Sarah Fisler. So, should we have a little look at your hand? Is that OK? Uh, yeah. All right. Gosh, you've been brave, haven't you? Yeah. So, are you able to bend your fingers for me? Well done. And can you feel me touching your hand? Yeah. Yeah. Here comes a gross alert. That's a nasty cut on your finger, Haddy. But is there any glass in it? 
Paddy needs an X-ray, which will show any glass stuck in his hand. Thank you. What's the news, Doc? The good news is that there isn't any glass. Yes. <laughs> so we just need to give it a bit of a clean, so it won't hurt. No glass and no stitches. That serves a round of applause. <laughs> hey, break a leg in your school play, Haddy. On second thoughts, maybe not. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bye.